Hello, in this video, we will show you how to live stream your AirMeet session to YouTube, Facebook, and any other destination that accepts RTMP as an input. Now, to set up your live stream for your AirMeet session, go to your dashboard. You'll find the live stream option at the bottom. Once you click on it, you'll be prompted to decide whether you want to live stream it to Facebook, YouTube, or any other destination. Let me go ahead and select Facebook. I can stream it to Facebook page, Facebook profile. Once I select on Facebook page, I will be prompted to link my account. Continue. I select the pages that I want to live stream it to. Do notice that we can actually live stream it to multiple destinations at once. I give the required permissions. And my Facebook account is linked. It asks me which Facebook page I want to live stream my session to. I select that. I select the sessions which I want to live stream. I can select all sessions at once, or I can select sessions as per my choice. I select session three and four. I give it the title, knowledge base one, live streaming, add destination, and my Facebook page is linked. Now let me add another destination. This time around, let's do a YouTube channel. I select on YouTube channel. I decide which handle I want to link it to. It asks me for the permissions. I allow it. And my YouTube handle is saved as well as a destination. Again, I select the sessions I want to stream. So I select welcome session and session four. Next, I give it titles. I can also decide whether I want it to be public stream, private or unlisted. I select public. I add that, that as a destination. We can also stream it to a custom RTMP destination. For that will require parameters such as stream URL, stream key. I have those handy. So let me just copy paste it so that I set up for custom RTMP as well. I see the stream key, stream URL, page URL as well. And I give it a nickname, say page URL. Again, I decide which sessions I want to stream. Select next. And you notice that I've decided all my stream options. Now, let me actually go to the session, play it live, and then show you how it's getting live stream. So we've decided session four as the session that we want to live stream it. Let me go to the pack stage. Let me start my session. As usual, there will be the 10 second countdown. Post the countdown, the session will go live. And then in some time, it will also go live on YouTube and Facebook. Uh, do notice this important or keep in mind this important thing that it's recommended not to take a break between your live stream and the session that you're doing if you uh, do that it will the live stream will get split in two parts yeah so now you can notice that this is actually getting live stream to three destinations as we had said the stream the custom rtmp the facebook page that we had selected and also the youtube handle in case you want to delink it right what you can do is you can come back to the dashboard you can Come in here and decide whether you want to delink it. All you have to do is press on remove, remove, and these destinations will be removed. To ensure that you don't have to link it every time, what you can also do is go to your dashboard. And here in the stream destinations, these get saved, right? So every time you want to stream your sessions, you don't have to add it every time. You can actually do it at the community level, and this will be available for all your events. Hope you like this video and uh, look forward to your comments. Thank you.